We're here at Vallarta. We're gonna grab every single Mexican snack and rank them. Come on, let's go. Let's go around. There's like so many things in this store. A gancito. I like a random snack with a random animal that doesn't make sense with the snack. Barritas? Ooh, I don't know what that is. I'll get that. Spunk? Submarinos? I'm gonna get this. It looks good. It looks like a Twinkie. Pinguinos? Canalitas? There's a lot of things going on here. Coconut candies here. We got the olas, quechitos, a wafer. It's so cool because like I don't know anything, so everything is like so new to me. Is De La Rosa good? Puporindots? Fire Kids Sandia? What is this? This looks good. Chocolate coins. It's a spoon with stuff inside. Caritos de elotes. We got lollipops right here. Vero mango, vero elotes. We got mara sandia, tamalito. We got duvalin, squinkle. Anything that involves a little carton like this is probably really good. This is the el pec pec, el pec, el pecky. Chocoroles, Nepolitano, Rocco. Sandwich with lime flavor and oh, Principe. There's more, I got donuts. We got nitos. We got pound cake. This is so overwhelming. It's my birthday. Cuernitos, Monte Caras, chocolate croissant. Mm. We're here at the soda sections. You gotta get the jaritos. We got grapefruit flavor, pineapple flavor, mandarin flavor, fruit punch, tamarind, strawberry. I'm gonna tell you later which one is the best when I rank them. We got Mexican Cola flavored, sangria, apple cider right here, Mexican Sprite right here, freaking apple, manzanita sol, tepachito, 7-Up, squirt, and don't forget, come up here. It's not glass though, but we got, yo girl, guava. Mm -hmm. They got chicharron. <laughs> Freaking the size of my body. This is wild, dude. Compared to like the Filipino snacks, this is a lot, and I am excited. Okay, so the Viarta did not have any chips, so we went across the street. So we're gonna go grab some chips, come on. So we're gonna grab rancheritos, fritos, some fritos, torcitos. Look at that, we have so much freaking flavor. It's so different. I'm gonna grab this. Ricatones, pepes gigante, sabritas, looks like a lace. And then we have Cheetos, look at that. So I figured since we're in a panaderia, we might as well grab some pastry. Look, so, so far I have all these. I'm not sure what they are, but it's delicious. This looks like a puffer fish. Let me grab this one. Oh my God. Boom, boom, boom. So one of the guys in there gave me a free cholo. It's freaking beans, cheese, chorizo, and a freaking bread sandwich. Oh, so good. But you know what's crazy? We have so many snacks. I'm so scared I'm gonna explode. We're back in the kitchen. I'm gonna just start with this. De La Rosa, because apparently this is very popular. If you know what a pulveron is, if you're Filipino, this is the pulveron of Mexico. This is the little packaging right here. This is De La Rosa. Mm. It's like a crunchier pulveron. It's like crunchy. That was delightful. De La Rosa, Alien A tier. I'm gonna put an A tier. That's freaking good, man. Was not expecting that. So we're gonna move on to tamarind candy. So for you folks who don't know what a tamarind is, right here, definition. Okay. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, that's good. I used to have a lot of these in the Philippines. I like this. But which tamarind candy is the best? This is also a tamarind candy. Dedos. Hmm. Nah, I'm good. Purpurin dots. Oh, look at that. Little tamarind balls. Tamarind balls. I like it. It's good. Taruguitos. It's just a bigger version of the ball or the little dot thing. Mmm. It's good. It does the job. Basito. It's like a little cup thing. Okay. Oh, look at that. It's like a little play doh. Oh. Whoa. I like it. I do. But out of all the tamarinds, Pupurindo, it just does a job. Good enough to fit in your pocket. Easy to eat. I'm gonna put this right here. It's actually A tier. It was pretty good. I like it a lot. We have the milk candy and wafer. It's a wafer, but in the middle it's condensed milk. 
that's kind of basically been burned. Oh, I'm gonna just break it open. I feel like I know you already. Yeah, I like it. I love condensed milk, okay? I grew up with condensed milk. My blood runs in condensed milk. When I was eight, I went to the hospital because I ate too much condensed milk. This is, I, this is my ass here, bro. I'm putting this on here. I love freaking condensed milk. Mm. It's so good. It's like sugary, like caramel, like, mm. Mm. So we got bimbo donuts. So it's like donuts, I guess. Mm. It really is like hostess. This one's okay. It reminds me of American food. Let's put this on the side. Let's put you on the F tier. It tastes like America. We got croissant. <laughs> croissant? <laughs> Looks like a larvae. Oh, oh. You can tell already it's dry. You don't deserve to be on the wall croissant. We got some mini mantecadas, vanilla mini muffins. It just tastes like American food. Oh, pound cake! <laughs> Why did it fall like that? Oh. Yeah, that one was okay. All of these you can find in America. Just go find it in the grocery store. Bimbunuelos. We have bimbunuelos, also known as sweet crispy wheels. So this is probably the most unique bimbos. <laughs> wheels, the wheels on the bus go brown. It's a nice crispy wheel with uh, some powdered sugar. It's like a super fried funnel cake uh, with some powdered sugar. Mm -hmm. Super crispy, that's yeah, not bad. Yeah, I can put this in the wall for sure. I like it, I'll put it in a C. See, bimboyalos. We got two more bimbos, Kironitos, which is the croissant. Uh. Nito, chocolate cream filled sweet bread, good pando col delice. Ooh. Looks like a, a long donut. That is dry. I had high expectations for you. It doesn't deserve to be in the wall. That one's good though. So out of all the bimbo, in my opinion, this is not financial advice. This is the only thing that's good from all the bimbos. So let's move on to some salty snacks. We have sabritas, which is salt and lime flavored peanuts. Very pleasant, I like it. Tastes like planters with a little bit of lime. Next up we have Mexican style mixed flavored sabritas. Oh, I know it's gonna be a little spicy. I love spicy. Mm. A little lemony, a little spicy, it's good. I like it. I actually like it better than the lime. It's lemon flavored salted apricot. You say apricot or apricot? <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below. Comment down below your favorite number if you say apricot. Just looks like a moon bug. Ooh, that sour. That sour. That was the saltiest, sourest thing I've tasted. Wow, if you want a challenge, get a whole bag of this. All right, definitely not on the board. It's just so freaking sour. You want to see again? I'll put the whole bag. If you want to see it, I'll put this. Freaking... So what I'm waiting for is this. Look how big this chicharron is, dude. Look at that. Let's try these Cheetos. So apparently these Cheetos poofs taste different. Oh my gosh, it's a little bit Red orange color, it's dark orange. Wow, does it mean it's cheesier? Mmm, yeah, oh, it's different. Whoa, tastes like like not nacho cheese you get from like the movies. Mmm, I like it. All right, Cheetos poofs, I'm gonna put you right here. Look at that, it's actually pretty good. I didn't expect that. Flaming hot Tostitos, yeah? Is that flaming hot? Whoa! Mmm, <laughs> I like it. Put you right there. Let's take a little break. Let's do a little bit of a, I'm thirsty. Let's try this Mexican Sprite out. I've never actually had Mexican Sprite. That was good, that was good. It's balanced. Ow, 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 ow. I like it. I'm putting you on B. You're a really good B tier thing. 
Fritos. We got chili and lime flavored corn chips. Oddly enough, it tastes very similar. Salt and lemon Fritos. Yeah, the same, same tier as the other Fritos. Nothing too crazy. We got Tostitos with salsa. Ooh, they already infused the salsa in the Tostitos. Mmm, I like it, I do. I'll put you right here with your friend. Let's open these cookies. It's like a Chips Ahoy. But it's better. Whoa. I don't know. It's not as artificially artificial like Chips Ahoy, but it's like less artificial than Chips Ahoy. Nah, I'll put you on the F though. You deserve to be in here, but all the way down. We got some cinnamon cookies, okay? Canalitas. Ooh, look at that. Nah, that one's okay. Polvorones! This one specifically is a shortbread orange cookie. Look at that. That looks like a Nila wafer. Interesting. It's a hit or miss. People like orangey things. Some people don't. I put it in the same tier as the Tricky Trackies. Right there in the F tier. I'm a little bit thirsty. Let's get some of this squirt. Oh, it's nice. It's very citrusy. <coughs> yeah, that's good. It does the nectary job. This one, I'm curious. Mexican 7-Up. Whoa. Okay, I like it. 7-Up, pretty good. So I'm putting you in the B tier. This is the mandarin flavored jaritos. Oh. I don't remember it being tasting like that. Maybe it was it something else? C tier. I'm gonna settle this once and for all. Which Haritos flavor is the best? Only my opinion matters. You shouldn't listen to anyone else's opinion because these are facts. facts. Starting it off, tamarind flavored Haritos. That's good. Pineapple flavored. Ooh, this one. This better be good because I love pineapple. Artificial. Fruit punch, ooh, interesting. Fruit punch reminds me of a Hawaiian punch. Every time I see that. Uh, this one goes back here. Grapefruit, it's kind of like a squirt. Squirt is also grapefruit. Okay, uh, this goes right here next to the pineapple. Strawberry good? We'll find out. Oh, ooh, uh. It tastes like a fruit. It's too sweet. Mexican cola. Haritos. Ugh. Uh. Look, they tried hard, but it tastes like artificial Pepsi. But last but not least, you forgot. Remember in the store, I was like, oh, I'm gonna get this one. Mm, you forgot already, huh? Have you been paying retention? You forgot about your girl, Guava. Guava, how are you doing, darling? I'm well, how are you? <laughs> remember? I made this face. Uh, now you remember. Uh, dang, I'm sorry, guava, dude. I'm gonna put you like right next to the pineapple. Let me just try this one more time. All right, so winner, I think mandarin, and then tamarind, and then piña, then guava, and then the grapefruit one. That solves the case. Good job, good job. Sponsor me, Haritos. I've been drinking you for about 20 years now. So if you're watching this, please sponsor me. Also splash that subscribe button for me. Thank you, appreciate it. Splash. Look how big this freaking chicharron is. We're gonna eat that in a little bit, but we're gonna start off with these chips first. Ricachones. Good. Well, it does the job, like really well. Mm. Do we have any hot sauce? We have tapatio. This should be okay. Oh, it's good, I like it. I'm gonna put it on um, B tier. Richaconis, I like it. Sabritas, so this one's the one that looks like Lay's chips. It looks like Lay's chips. Does it taste like Lay's chips? Does it taste very similar? No, it's different. It's like a more dense potato. You take two potatoes, mash it into one potato chips, you get this bag right here. It's pretty good. I put you, uh, I guess you're, you're a good beats here. Put you in the B tier. Very good. Rancheritos. So this is the tortilla chips with chili papers and some spice. Ooh, look at that. That's gonna be flavorful. 
Mmm. Yeah, just a job. Just like a little bit of barbecue, a little bit of spiciness. Good seeds here. Pepe's Gigante. Woo. Okay, here we go. That's good. Put you right here. On the D tier. Here we go. We have the almighty giant chicharron. All right, let's bring this baby out. Oh, this used to be a pork skin. Yo, that is good. Oh, that is the loudest crunch I have ever heard. I put you uh, A through D tier. <laughs> right here, just in between A and B. Jeez, all that saltiness making me a little bit thirsty. So we're gonna try this one. Cidral Mundret. It's an apple flavored beverage. Oh, I like it. It's like apple juice. It's like a ginger ale of apple juice, if that makes sense. I like this one. Actually, no, I like, I'm putting you S. S looking lonely up here. All right, freaking apple juice soda. Who would have known that would have just smacked me in my belly button. So these have been staring at me for the past six hours and uh, we'll try it out. Pink cookie. Yeah, that's pretty good. It doesn't taste like strawberry. It's just a pink, really good cookie. <laughs> this puffer fish looking thing. It's like a softer cookie. I like it. This is an elephant ear. Mmm. Concha. Mm. Oh, yo. This concha is good. It's like a pastry, a little bit of sugar on top. It just wraps your tongue very nicely and then just kind of goes down your throat. All right, this is concha version two. Look at this. Mm. Bro, I'm gonna put all the pastries on the S tier. Next up, we have Sambarinos, all right? It's a submarine but it's filled with vanilla. Oh, it's basically a freaking Twinkie. Oh my God, this is a, a Mexican Twinkie. Oh, it's, oh, it's more filling. Cause you know Twinkies, they lack in the cream. This one, there's a lot of cream. I like it. I <laughs> like it, it's good. Napolitano. Oh, looks like a zebra cake. Oh, let me open it up. No, nothing. It's still like nice. Whoa, is it lemon? It's orange. There are a lot of orange flavored things. It's good. I'll put you on the F tier. Nusita Monedas. Nusita Monedas. This is a chocolate flavored candy coins. So presentation S tier for sure. Does it taste good? Here we go. This one was okay. It's fun though. I've been eyeing on this the whole entire video. Spoons. It's little tamarind things. It's like little sweet bites in the tip of your spoon. And you get a free spoon too. That's freaking, that's a deal. Ooh. <laughs> I can suck that. I actually like it a lot. I put Pachu in the A tier next to your friend Pulparindo. The gancito, it's a little cake thing shaped like a Twinkie, but it's freaking chocolate coated. And then when you open it, you get layers of like cream and a little bit of jam slash jelly. Think about that for a sec. Mmm, I like it. But what's even more insane, if you freeze it, all right, That went from like a B tier to an A tier just by freezing it. But you, right here, the frozen one at least. All right, okay, hey, let's look at our current tier board. So far we got um, the condensed milk wafer, apple juice, and every single panaderia as the, the S tier, and then everything else. I really wanna try this spunk. Sponge. So this is, uh, I'm gonna go for this, but we're gonna do lollipops first. So we got mango flavored lollipops. Let's try this out. Wow, look at that. It looks like a teardrop. Mm. 
It's like a fruit, but it's spicy. Next up, we have the elote. Elote lollipop. It's like a corn lollipop. Look at that. Even the stick is coated. Just in case you want to suck the stick it. That one's okay. Tamarind. So it's covered in corn husks. Oh, look at that. Oh, maybe you're supposed to push it out like that. Mmm. Tastes like tamarind with body soap. We got Mara Sandia. This is watermelon with a little bit of a, I guess, tahini or something. Something spicy. Mmm. Oh, this one's okay. Spunk. A marshmallow cookie, coconut, and strawberry. That looks delicious. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It looks so freaking cute. Look at that. And there's a design on the back. Ooh. Yeah, it's okay. Very disappointing. I had a high expectation. It's still good though. Maybe because I was expecting a lot from it. I mean, I'll put it right here. Same tiers as like Bambinos and stuff right here in the bottom. All right, Rocco. It's like a moon pie. Is it a moon pie? <laughs> it is like a moon pie. Same tier. I feel like all these tiers are just the same. If it's there, the only thing there, you get it. If not, you would rather go for some else. How about this thing? Slaps. Slaps! This one's a little bit fun, because all you gotta do here, you can do whatever you want. You wanna fold it, fold it in half, and if you wanna make it tall, you fold it in half long ways. It's like a fruit roll-up, except it's a lollipop. Look at that, look at that. Now you just eat it. Mmm. Mmm, I like it! Let's put it on here. I put it on the beak here, it's pretty good. Principe! Sandwich cookies with lime flavored filling. Mmm. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Whoa! That's good! Did not expect to like that as much as I did. I'll put A tier. A tier! We got the, the lime flavored filling biscuits. Choco Rolls! It's like a longer Swiss roll. Long Swiss roll, huh? Mmm. Mmm. That one's okay. Pinguinos! It tastes exactly how you think it tastes. America. Hola! We got quechitos! Tamarind flavored coated fruit pieces. It's like a jelly bean, but tamarind. Yeah, the coconut candy. Here we go. Mmm. Tastes like cassava cake in the Philippines. If you don't want cassava cake, it's right here. Very good. That'll be the first D tier. Just because it reminds me of cassava cake. Baritas! Strawberry filled cookies. Oh, it looks like a hot dog. <laughs> this one's not bad. F tier. Okay, I just my mind. D tier. Okay, we got squingles. You know I love spaghetti, right? So this is just a spaghetti. Oh! Oh, this is some tamarind chamoy. Look at that. You just put that in the spaghetti. You just mix it around. And you eat it. Oh, it's not bad. I like it. Oh, I like it. It's like a sour gummy worm, but skinnier with sauce. Mmm, I like it. I'll put you in beats here. <laughs> oh, we're going back to Olas. Remember the last time I had Olas, it disintegrated the roof of my mouth. <laughs> So this one is the wet version of it because it's a freaking plum. So this is a plum. You see this plum? Okay, pleasant. Come here. Okay. Next up, we got Duvalin. <laughs> oh, we got Chick-fil-A packets. Look at this. Is it yogurt? Something like yogurt? So it comes with a little spoon. So cute. Oh, I like it. There's a little texture in there. It's like thick. So you really do get every single bite out of it. Putting you next to the hola. Manzanita Sol. That means apple of the sun. That's good. Sangria Señorial. Tepachito. Pineapple and coconut. So it's like a piño colada. This is the rocaleta. Oh, it's a lollipop. Oh, this is the circlest lollipop I've ever seen. It's good. 
Pelon Pelonazo. Is it gooey? Oh, what is this? Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, that tastes like tamarind. <laughs> How do I know? It's tamarind. But it's good though. I'ma put you on the fridge. There's no more space. Look at this. How oh, do I? It's so hard to read that. Last but not least, we couldn't find the Lucas, so we got Zumba Acidin. It's a tangy seasoning. Mmm, that's sour. Thank you for watching today's video. I really hope you have an amazing time with me, your host, Roy Fabito. Ah, ah, ah. Peace. <laughs>